Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Um, if you guys are new to this channel, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for future content. All right, so today I'm gonna to be showing you guys five exercises that you can do just using dumbbells. And basically these exercises are designed to accelerate fat burning. So they're gonna be full body movements that you can incorporate on whatever day that you wanna incorporate. And basically these exercises are designed to accelerate fat burning and work multiple muscle groups in your body. All right guys, so exercise number one is actually one of my personal favorites. Our goal is 15 repetitions. Um, basically we're gonna do squat into a military press. So it's very basic movement, but it gets the entire body involved, especially the core and the anterior deltoids. First thing you wanna do is grab the dumbbells, bring them right in front of your shoulders. From here, you're gonna drop down into your deepest squat while keeping your core engaged. Deepest squat, keep the core engaged, press above the head, all right? So we're gonna do 15 reps. Let's get it. So that move, move engages the entire body, the core, anterior deltoids, quads, and when you drop below parallel, you have to use your posterior chain, which is your glutes and your hamstrings, to pick yourself up. All right guys, so this next exercise that we're gonna do, um, it's two variations to it. One is a little bit more difficult, one is less difficult. So this is burpee into a dumbbell renegade row. Uh, so basically, if you wanna make it more difficult, what you can do is when you go into a burpee, you can add a push-up. If you wanna make it less difficult, just take the push-up completely out. Um, so I'm gonna do mines with the push-up. The goal is 10 reps because we're doing two moves that's very taxing on the body. So it's a lot of movement. So this is considered a high rep range for this exercise. So I'ma just demonstrate one just to show y'all how to do it. And then we're gonna dive into it, all right? So first things first, grab your dumbbells. Once you do that, you're coming out. This is the more difficult version. Jump out to a burpee, push up, roll, roll. Stand tall, that's one, all right? So we're gonna shoot for 10 reps, all right? Let's get it. So that exercise works pretty much everything as well. Really elevates the heart rate and you're moving weight. So you kill two birds with one stone. You get your cardio in and you get your resistance training in. Major. All right guys, so this next exercise is a seated Arnold press. And I love to incorporate this movement because it makes me engage the core a lot more when I'm seated on, when I'm seating, sorry, I can't talk today. <laughs> when I'm sitting on the floor, because what it does is it decreases stability so you don't have any leverage. So your core is working a lot more because of it. Get your legs out wide, just sit flat, grab your dumbbells, bring them in front of your face, rotate out and up, rotate out. When you press, it's very important to get your shoulders behind your ears, bring the dumbbells right in front of the chin. All right, so our desired rep range is 15. So we're about to hit 15. Let's get it. Keep the reps high. So this next move, I don't like to incorporate often, but this is a great move if you're trying to burn out your entire body. All right, so this is a compound exercise because we're working 
multiple, multiple, multiple muscle groups. This exercise is a reverse lunge into a bicep curl. So I'm gonna show y'all how to do it. <clears throat> All right, first thing you wanna do is grab your dumbbells. So we're gonna alternate sides on this one. So reverse lunge, turn it out, curl, back, reverse lunge, turn them out, curl. That's one rep, all right? So we wanna get to 10, so that's the goal. So let's get it. That is a burner. All right guys, last move of the day. Y'all know I love to save the hardest exercises for last. So this exercise is two variations as well. It's one that's easier and it's one that's a little bit more difficult. So the one that's more difficult is obviously the one that you add the push up in because we're doing burpee, push up, jump lunge, right? And if you wanna make it easier, then you just do burpee into a jump lunge, all right? So what I'm gonna do is the more difficult way, obviously, with the push-up and adding in the jump lunge. So for this exercise, we're gonna do a total of 10 reps. That's the goal. The reason why is because we're doing multiple movements. So that's actually a high rep range for this type of exercise. So I'm gonna demonstrate, and then we're gonna dive in. All right, so grab your dumbbells. First thing you wanna do is bring them here. Jump out into your burpee, push up, jump up, jump lunge, jump lunge. All right, that's one rep. So we're shooting for 10. All right, last move, let's get it. Super killer, guys. That's a wrap. As you can see, I'm drenched in sweat. The workout was amazing. So these exercises are designed to work your entire body. So if you're short on time, these exercises are perfect for that because they work multiple muscle groups, basically getting you to the meat and potatoes without any time wasted. So it's very important to understand that if you wanna burn fat and build muscle, then you have to combine resistance training with cardio and that's gonna get you there the fastest, all right? So elevating your heart rate while doing resistance training gets you there the fastest. If anybody that know me, that been following me for a while, you guys know that I like to train a variety of ways. So I train athletically, I do strength training, I can even do a bodybuilding style training even though that's not my forte. Uh, I'm more so specialized in just lifestyle fitness, all right? So these exercises are pretty much for your lifestyle and they hit multiple muscle groups and you can get straight to the meat and potatoes without wasting any time, all right? So as always, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And if this information was helpful, for, helpful to you, um, let me know in the comment section. Let me know what y'all wanna see next. And as always, be blessed. I'm out.